Hey gamers, how are you today? So today we're going to take a look at the uh, Finecast model, finally. Got my hands on one. And uh, this is a um, Necron Lord with the Resurrection Orb. So let's take a look inside um, of this Finecast model that everyone hates, almost everyone actually. Already open it a little bit, as you can see, because it's pretty hard to open uh, even with the hobby knife. So, as you can see as well, there's no instruction guide inside. We'll have to guess how to assemble this model, but I guess it's not very, not that difficult. So inside you have two sprues, um, a little bit of flash, <laughs> uh, a base. And uh, a sprue with the with the um, the rods, necron rods, typical from necron. So let's let's have a look to the first sprue. Let me zoom a little bit so you can see the details. That's right. So it's the main body, as you can see. A little bit of flash over here, but it's fine. The back. These things that you can see, you see here um, actually will need to be cut out because this is to uh, avoid to have uh, air bubble trapped in the model because they are normally upside down and they, they pour the, um, the resin from this side and well, it fills up the, the mold till here and to avoid to have uh, air bubble trap, this is a little escape route for the bubbles to go. So that's what this is, but you have to cut it after uh, when you're assembling your model. So this is the first sprue. Let's take a look to the other one. So we have here the, um, the weapon and the right arm. This is the left arm with the orb. You can see more in detail. And this is a little bit of um, something to put uh, on the base. This is uh, some crystals. And this is the other side. And this is the point of the tip, I mean, uh, of the, the weapon. So, uh, as you can see, there's not too much. Uh, ab actually, I bought this uh, online, so it was kind of risky because you cannot really see the, the model because when you're in a shop you see this, you can still have a look on the back to see if there is some miscast or something but online uh, you get what you get so I think I was pretty lucky on my first buy because as you can see there's not much air bubble, there's one here a big one but it's not uh, uh, something I cannot repair and actually I don't know if you can zoom more but you can see here there's a lot more little ones, but that can be easily repaired as well. As you can see on this side. And um, apparently, on this sprue, that's it. There's no more defects beside the flash, but that's not a problem. And on the body, looks like this is a uh, not air bubble trap. This is normal. <laughs> this is escape. So don't worry about that. Some flash again here. And uh, yeah, I think uh, we're pretty good with the, this model. There's no no miscasts that I can see actually nor air bubble, so I was pretty lucky, but uh, nevertheless I think it's not acceptable that when you buy something you get uh, so many mistakes and miscasts like you can see on other videos from other users, but anyway uh, about this fine cast, let's see, uh, it's pretty uh, light it even looks like it's lighter than plastic and actually it's flexible, as you can see I can, um, it's uh, pretty flexible, so if it's flexible I guess it's less 
breakable, let's, let's say like that, so maybe it's a good thing. Well, um, so yeah, I don't know. Um, I used to like the, the metal ones, but what you can do? And they, they wanted to change, so well, let's see uh, when this will be assembled and painted. What's if it's uh, better than metal or easier? Uh, if it's um, different, I don't know. What do you guys think about the fine cast? Mm, many pe people have seen comments, don't really like it. Uh, I myself, I don't really like it. I prefer metal, but well. It's more the miscast thing and the air bubble trap everywhere that makes uh, cause me a problem with the fine cast. And um, but I was lucky on my first buy, so I hope it will stay like that <laughs> on future one. So yeah. So guys, uh, thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe uh, if you didn't yet. Uh, like this video as well, and uh, also. Give a comment on what you think about um, Fancast, if you like it or not, if you have had already unlucky buys with the um, miscast and stuff. I hope not, but yeah, I know it happens a lot, so what do you think guys? And also what do you think about this model in-game and also um, if it looks good, I pretty like it, it's pretty, pretty cool I think. So yeah. That will be uh, in um, in my army pretty soon because I'm pretty excited to build this and paint it. So, so yeah, thank you for watching this uh, video. I hope you like it and see you on my next videos.